In the latest episode of the ESPN soap opera, titled As the Ratings Tumble, former NFL player turned talk show host Pat McAfee has accused ESPN executive Norby Williamson of playing the role of the villain. McAfee, known for his candid remarks and infectious personality, didn't mince words when he labeled Williamson a rat during his Friday show. In a move that could be described as ballsy or downright reckless, McAfee accused Williamson of attempting to sabotage his show by leaking inaccurate ratings information. It's like Shakespeare, but with more touchdowns and fewer iambic pentameters. I believe, Norby Williamson is the guy who is attempting to sabotage our program, McAfee declared, leaving viewers on the edge of their ergonomic office chairs, popcorn in hand, awaiting the next plot twist in this unfolding drama. Now, we're not legal experts, but calling out your employer's executive on their own network seems like a strategy taken straight from the How to Make Friends and Influence People ESPN Edition Handbook. But hey, who needs a harmonious relationship when you can have a feud that rivals the Montags and Capulets? McAfee doubled down on his accusations, suggesting that someone leaked misinformation about his show's ratings, setting a narrative that could make a Kardashian blush. It's a classic case of he said rat said, with plenty of behind the scenes drama to keep the audience hooked. Ah, uh, re we just gonna combat that from a rat every single time? McAfee questioned, pondering the age old philosophical query of whether one should respond to workplace strife with a vermin based counterattack. It's a question for the ages, really. But let's not forget the overarching plot here McAfee versus the ESPN family. According to the man himself, there are shadowy figures within the network who didn't exactly throw a welcome party when the Pat McAfee show joined the ESPN lineup. Cue the ominous music. While McAfee might believe he's the hero in this tale, bravely fighting against internal enemies, others might see this as a classic case of biting the hand that feeds. In the world of sports broadcasting, it's not unheard of for on-air personalities to clash with the suits upstairs but rarely do we get such a front row seat to the spectacle. Maybe McAfee will emerge victorious, wielding more power than ever before. Perhaps Williamson will exit stage left, pursued by a bear. Or maybe, just maybe, this public spat will lead to an amicable parting of ways, and ESPN will be left wondering if it was something they said. In any case, we'll be here, sitting back with our virtual popcorn, waiting to see whether this is the beginning of a beautiful rivalry or merely a blip in the grand scheme of ESPN's programming. Stay tuned, sports fans, the game is far from over.